this exercise we'll review how to quickly turn note text into geometry. We'll then extrude the geometry to create a solid model of the note. When we create a note there's an option to create it as geometry immediately. We can do this or alternatively simply place the note on the screen and use the generic burst afterwards. We'll format the text as Arial filled so we can get closed profiles to extrude. We could alternatively use a non-filled smooth font that would drive an engraving cutter. We'll create a note without checking the Create as Geometry option and place it on the screen. Then we'll use the generic burst icon and burst the note twice. The first burst breaks the note into splines and polylines. The second burst breaks the polylines into lines. We'll then extrude the geometry into solid shapes. So let's work with an actual file. We'll open up a new file in view 7, construction plane equals 1. And let's click on the note key in option. We're going to type the word cat, C-A-T, capital letters and click on formatting and for formatting we're going to format Arial 0.5 high filled click on OK now we'll place that note on the screen let's use a generic burst and burst the note one time Now if we go and look at this, we have splines, lines, and polylines. We can get rid of the polylines by bursting the note again. Just select everything. And after we do it this time, you'll notice that we now have just lines and splines. Let's click on the extrude icon. We'll type 0.3 for the length and then click on OK and we'll select all of the geometry on the screen and a downward facing vector. We now have solids and we can just lighten them up. We'll change to a lighter color so it's easy to see all of the geometry. And it's a very very simple way to turn that into a solid. So let's recap. In this exercise we reviewed how to quickly turn note text into geometry. We then extruded the geometry to create a solid model of the note. When we create a note, there is an option to create it as geometry immediately. We can do this or alternatively simply place the note on the screen and generic burst it afterward. We formatted the text as Arial filled so we could get closed profiles to extrude. We could alternatively use a non-filled smooth font that would drive a single line path for an engraving cutter. We created a note without checking the Create as Geometry option and placed it on the screen. Then we used the generic burst icon and burst the note twice. The first burst broke the note into splines and polylines. And the second burst broke the polylines into lines. We then extruded the geometry into solid shapes.